Hey guys, my name is Whitney Myers from Whitney'sBodyArt.com. I'm going to share a quick tip with you today. Um, I make most of my own rainbows uh, just so I can customize my color options and have a little more control over that. And so I always put them in a, a different container. These are jewelry cases. But part of the problem with making your own rainbows is sometimes you have to use your old paint that maybe you have extras of and it's dried out, it's crumbly, it's really difficult to work with and people have a really hard time making a nice rainbow out of it. Um, one of the ways to solve that problem is you can take a plastic baggie and you take your dried up paint and you just put it in the bag and then you'll add, I'm not going to do it so I don't ruin my paint, but you'll add maybe about a quarter of a teaspoon of water in with your paint and then you close it up you leave it overnight and you'll end up with paint that's about the consistency of icing and so you just cut a tip in your your bag and you squeeze it out into your trays just as you would with icing and um, you leave it there about 24 hours let it dry and you have a nice uh, straight line to start making rainbow cakes with